I'm at the metro station at Hamad International Airport in Qatar. Now above me, thousands of fans are going to be arriving on a daily basis for the FIFA World Cup. So today, I'm going to head to three stadiums by the metro and shuttle buses to see how easy it is to navigate around Qatar. Hi. The matches will be played in eight stadiums. Al Janoub, Thumama, Lusail and Al Bayt can be reached from the red line, Education City and Ahmed Bin Ali from the green, and Stadium 974 and Khalifa International from the gold. This metro began operating in 2019 and can reach speeds of 100 kilometers an hour, making it one of the fastest driverless trains in the world. This is Stadium 974. Now it's a 30 minute walk away from Ras Abu Abu metro station, or you can just hop on a shuttle. Now it's named after Qatar's international dining code, but also the number of containers used to build it. All three lines, the red, the gold, and the green, intersect right here in Mushayarov station. So let's hop onto the red and go to Lusail's QMB station. And this is Lusail Stadium. It's going to pack 80,000 fans and it's going to hold the final to the World Cup. Now you can see some of the intricate details of the building behind me. This is actually inspired by the Al Fanar lamp. That's the Arabic traditional candle lamp. Now this is just a jump off the shuttle towards the northern city of Al Khor where we have Al Bayt Stadium. Now this is built to look like a Bedouin tent and inside is awash with colour with a traditional sadhu pattern. Again, an ultra-modern stadium with a nod to Qatar's history. So there you have it, three stadiums by a metro and shuttle bus in one day. And I'm not going to end my day there, I've come back to Lusail Boulevard which is lined with shops, restaurants and has a real festival atmosphere. Thank you.